After only two pin adjustments, React technology from Trophy Ridge delivers dead center accuracy at any distance. No other technology sights you in this fast and that easy. Sight in at 20 and 30 yards and React automatically sights you in at 40, 50 and 60 yards without needing to make any other adjustments. React technology, only from Trophy Ridge. Hi, I'm Josh from Trophy Ridge, and I'm here to talk to you about the all-new React Pro site from Trophy Ridge. The Pro combines our React technology with all the features that you'd want in a high-end target site. It's lighter, stronger, and more adjustable than comparable sites on the market. The React Pro has every feature that a serious archer demands. Solid aluminum construction, toolless micro-adjust with clicks, second and third axis adjustment, and weighs just 9.5 ounces. On top of all that, it includes the exclusive React technology only from Trophy Ridge. If you're not familiar with our React technology, this is the mechanism that allows you to sight in your five pins more accurately and efficiently than any other site on the market. The first step is to dial in your 20-yard pin. The 20-yard pin is your top pin and it's fixed to the housing. So in order to do that, you adjust your toolless micro click adjustment on your windage and elevation blocks. You move your sight up and down, left and right, to dial in your 20-yard pin. When sighting in your 20-yard pin, if you're hitting a little left, move the sight to the left. If you're hitting a little high, move the sight up. Follow where your arrow's hitting. Once your 20-yard pin is dialed in, all that's left to do is dial in one other distance. That could be your 30, 40, 50, or even 60-yard pin. I recommend sighting in the furthest distance that you are comfortable shooting. When sighting in your second pin, all you do is adjust the master adjustment knob on the top of the React sight. You'll notice as you move this knob, your 30 yard pin will move up and down accordingly. You'll also notice that the rest of your pins react to that adjustment. Notice that the 30 yard pin moves very slightly in comparison to the 60 yard pin. Once you have your 20 yard pin sighted in and one other pin in your housing, all five of your pins are dialed in. The trajectory and ballistics math included in the site will automatically set all your pin gaps based on just two distances. Another feature of this site is the adjustable second and third axis. The second axis sets the level of your sight when mounted on your bow and your bow is held vertical. To set this, loosen the two screws in the main mounting bracket and retighten when the level on your sight matches a level held on your bow riser. The third axis adjustment makes sure that your level stays centered as your bow is rotated, representing a steep uphill or downhill shot. There are many different methods and techniques to setting the third axis on your sight. One method is to put a level on your riser and rotate the bow down while keeping that level centered. What you're checking is to see that the level on your sight is matching the level on the riser. One additional new feature of the React Pro sight is the indicator scale found on the back side of the site. This scale indicates the gap between your 20 and 60 yard pin and can be used for reference when sighting in or when going back to a previous setup. Now that you can trust that all your pins are sighted in accurately, you can spend your time concentrating on your shot and your form to become a better archer. Hi, I'm Ralph Sanzarulo. And I'm Vicki Sanzarulo from Archer's Choice and the Choice TV shows. You know, trugo has got a whole bunch of new products out this year. And we can't wait to share them with you. The Carbon XS Extreme. It's an ultralight carbon composite archery sight. This is a sight that I am telling you it, it is absolutely amazing. They added more driven features than ever before, including a longer mounting bracket, extended windage and elevation adjustments, larger aperture, and even brighter pins. The ultralight carbon composite construction, this site weighs less than 4.2 ounces. It has the True Flow fiber design, which is an extra long fiber for maximum brightness. Here's some of the other things. It's got a reversible bracket for greater vertical adjustability. Right, and it's adjustable for left or right handed. Again, the new glow in the dark shooter's ring is alignment for the outer aperture ring for improved people lighting. Right, it's also included with a removable push button LED light. It comes in black, real tree extra, AP pink, lost, and lost AT camos. Bottom line to Carbon XS Extreme. Hi, I'm Kevin Wilkerson with Trophy Ridge, and I'm here today to show you the React V5. 
This is the first site in our lineup that combines both React technology and vertical inline pin technology, which are both exclusively at Trophy Ridge. Some of the really cool things about the React V5 is the React technology. And for some of you that don't know what that is, it allows you to side in your 20 yard pin with your elevation and windage blocks, and then side in one more distance, being your 30, 40, 50, or 60 yard pin. Once you sight that pin in with your bottom adjustment, all of your pins, 30, 40, 50, and 60 yard pins are going to move in conjunction with each other. Once you've sighted in that 20 yard and one other distance, you're mathematically impossible to be inaccurate at any of those distances. The React V5 also incorporates Ballistics Copolymer, which is the strength of aluminum but 25% lighter, and it has a soft touch feel for vibration reduction. It also has second axis adjustments. It has toolless micro click windage and elevation blocks, obviously a glow ring, a sight light, and a level for your shooting stability. Hi, Chris Ham from HHA Sports, here to talk today about the Optimizer Light Adjustable Hunting Site. Many of you are already familiar with this. It's noted by many as the top single pin in the industry. Uh, we've got a lot of exclusive features that our competitors don't. The most notable one is our patented Easy Tape system. Simply sight in at 20 and 60 or 20 and 40 yards, ultimately giving yourself a pre-printed tape from 20 to 80 yards in five yard increments, making for a very accurate sighting system with only one pin. Other exclusive features we have include our mechanical rheostat. It's an aluminum sleeve that threads over the fiber optics allowing the archer to brighten or dim the pin in the field without the use of a battery. Our totally toolless windage system allows for left-right windage adjustments, so once this sight's mounted to the bow, uh, there's no tools involved in adjusting it up, down, or left-right. The IQ Micro Bow Sight features Retina Lock technology. Micro adjust windage. Micro adjust elevation. Dual free locking knobs, built in sight level. The IQ features a 19,000s highly visible fiber optic pin that concentrates light using surgical steel tubing and a fiber that is nine times longer than a traditional sight fiber. This gives you an ultra bright aiming spot without having to use batteries, and this is legal in all states. A staggered, stack tight pin design. Adjustable second axis. For even brighter pins, the IQ is accessible with an adjustable rheostat light that's sold separately. The IQ Micro Bow Sight with the Retina Lock technology can prove to you that your aim can be off even when your pin is perfectly on. Take a look at this diagram. If your bow is torqued a quarter inch and the pin is on the target, your shot, because of your bow torque, is actually going to be off. In fact, over 5 inches at 20 yards and 10 inches at 40 yards. Now in this example, if your anchor point is a quarter inch high and your pin is on your target, your shot is still gonna be off. Once again, five inches at 20 yards and 10 inches at 40 yards. Now take a look at this perfect sight alignment using your retina lock. You can see that your actual shot impact is right where you have your pin. The retina lock shows that you have perfect hand position and perfect anchor position. You've centered the dot for the perfect shot. Now the IQ sight comes right out of the package, pre-assembled and ready to go. That's a really nice thing about it. What you're gonna find in the package in addition to the sight is some easy to follow instructions as well as a small package that's gonna contain four different Allen wrenches as well as a couple optional screws that you can use in your windage as well as your L elevation just in case you ever choose to remove the self-locking knobs that come standard on there. But what you wanna do is take the two screws that are the same, which are the ones that are gonna be used to mount the sight directly to the bow. Um, you're going to use the Allen key that is provided 
and you want to make sure that your sight is always firmly snug down. You want to make sure that there's no possibility for that to ever come loose. The next thing, and this is critical, as much as you're going to want to immediately start to play with that retina lock, it's going to be important that you do not touch the retina lock until you've sighted your bow in at 20 yards. This is very important. So the first thing that you're going to want to do, mount it to your bow and we're going to sight in at 20 yards. Now the IQ sight comes right out of the package with your top pin set to the upper third of your scope housing. And this is going to be important because you want to make sure that as you sight in all your individual pins, you don't want to run out of space down at the bottom of your sight. So you really want to make sure that your top pin is adjusted with the small screws for the individual pin adjustment so that your 20 yard pin or your top pin is at the upper third of the scope housing. And this is going to really help you once you sight in these longer distance pins. All right, now that we've got the IQ mounted to our bow, we're going to go ahead and take our first few shots. Don't expect to hit the perfect center on these first few ones because once again, this is only our starting point. And also, be sure to not focus on the retina lock right now. You want to get this bow sighted into 20 yards, so make sure you're at a safe distance and go ahead and make two good shots so that we can make our adjustments on our sight after we see where these first arrows land. I'm Kevin Wilkerson from Trophy Ridge, and I'm here to show you how to set up your React One Pro. Your first step is sighting in your 20 yard pin. You're going to do this using your micro windage and elevation blocks. If your arrow's moving left, move the pin to the left. If your arrow's hitting low, move your pin down. The whole point is to follow where your arrow is hitting to sight in your 20 yard pin. Once you get your 20 yard pin dialed in, the next step is to sight in one more distance. It could be 30, 40, or even 50 yards. And you're going to do that using your elevation drive knob. Once that is complete, turn the master adjustment screw until the pointer on the sight lines up with the corresponding yardage indicator. After you have two distances sighted in, React technology makes it mathematically impossible to be inaccurate out to 100 yards. 